Team Hugo. So our team um, went to, you know, spend a lot of time doing a concept, and uh, unfortunately we did not have we don't have put a time to share with you, but we'd love to share our idea, our idea with you. So Hugo is my pillbox companion. The problem we're trying to solve is that about 65 people who are of retirement age um, have adherence rates to their medication that are about 60% or less. You know, obviously this translates into health issues, um, poor, you know, confusion among the elderly, um, admittances to the ER that are unnecessary. There's a huge opportunity here to create better health outcomes for the elderly. One interesting problem, other than you know, forgetting your medication or being confused about the quantities, etc., which are solvable problems that many pillboxes do solve, is that patients are actually ambivalent about their ed and medication. They have negative reactions to taking um, medication from an emotional level. They hate feeling sick. They hate being reminded that they're dependent on pills. Um, also, it's a cumbersome and complex process. So, we gleaned from talking to patients for elderly, taking medication is a negative experience, even if it is life-saving. Here's an example of one of our target customers. She takes a lot of pills, but she doesn't feel that sick, and sometimes decides to skip her dosages. Here's an example of a customer who, a potential customer who is kind of depressed, maybe lonely, or dealing with the loss of a spouse, for example, and is just not motivated to take such good care of her own health. We thought there might be a solution in robotics. Robots have an amazing ability to be anthropomorphized into more than just machines. We make connections with them. We call Boomba a he or a Harry or look at that cute little you know, friend of mine. Or there, there, are, there are ways that we connect with robots that are, that are hard to explain. So perhaps there's an application in robotics that we can use to encourage people to stay on top of their medication. Maybe we can engage with user emotion with a slightly adorable reminder to take one's pills. Let me give you some examples. Meet Hugo. Hugo will provide some functionality, obviously. He will remind you to take your medicine. You know, he can buzz, move his ears, turn to the side. Hugo, Hugo though, will be annoyed if you're late in taking your medication. Turn red, frown, make, you know, annoyed noises. Hugo can be happy when you do actually go for them dispense the medication. He was kind of like your companion who cares about your health. He though is also, you know, got a, is intelligent. You can use this application to sort of track usage data. And each time you dispense a pill, that can be uploaded to a server, and you can track adherence rates on a website. This could be very valuable for the children of elderly parents. They may want to know, is my mom taking her cancer meds? And so this is a, this is a tool um, to also prevent the anxiety of, of caregivers. So we think this could, there's benefit to understanding adherence information across the healthcare system. This is something that is not very well understood today. So clearly, like physicians are included in that. The patient is empowered by it. The ER could benefit from knowing what did this patient take before they showed up today. And finally, this is at, in aggregate information that a pharmaceutical company could purchase. So the target user would be someone over 65 or you know, potentially elderly folks who take more than one medication. The target customer, however, would be the caregivers who are concerned. And the opportunity is potentially very large because there are about 25, 24 million patients age 65 or above who take one or more drugs every day. There's a lot of competition in the market for just pillboxes, not in a, a pillbox is an emotional connection. This is the uh, design and outcome. Great connections, a feeling of security around your you know, elderly friends and family's health. Um, facilitated through connecting to robot. Thank you very much. Uh, oh, by the way, our team is uh, Seisha, you want to come up? Uh, Seisha, Brazil, and Hiromi. Okay, that's it.